In the previous video, I showed you how to use Songify to display the song now playing in your Twitch chat when a user types exclamation mark song and the name of the name and authors of the song will pop up while using foobar. This method was also valid for VLC, but unfortunately Songify did a few updates which completely made it unusable. It would crash as soon as I open it or as soon as I top type the command, it will just crash. So I found a new method with the help of a friend. A uh, friend's channel will be linked in the description below. It's um, called Mix It Up. I will have Mix It Up download link also in the description below. So I will also link you to another video which I show you how to log into Mix It Up and how to set up a bot account with it. It will be in the description below. So once you've logged into Mix It Up, you're going to be very much present with the screen and seeing as you already have a file being written to by fubar or vlc a text file the name of, or the name of the song this is pretty straightforward it's actually very easy all you need to go to do is click here and go to commands you enter a new command um, you can say song or for this purpose i'm just going to say song test because i already have it uh, set up but you can just name it song I'm gonna call this now playing too because I already have that. Okay, and then the action what you want to do is you want a file read and write. And then click on this one, the plus. Not save to file, read from file. And you're gonna go browse. You're gonna go to the file which Fubar is writing to the song name. Okay. In my case it's this one now playing okay and then you type in response okay then you want to add another one which is a chat message okay and what you want to do is, is you want to type response and then you want to click save okay so now you've got this you can see that this is all set up and ready to go um, I'm just going to remove this one because I already have it in my general commands, which is the now playing. As you can see, I got file, response, same now playing, a text file that it's reading from, and with a response. So to test this, right, so now a song is playing. Okay, just to avoid copyright, I just muted it on my mixer. And when I type song, you can see that it will actually respond. My bot account, which is linked to the Mix It Up app, is actually responding. So yeah, you're all set up and ready to go. Thank you very much for tuning in. I do appreciate it. I hope this video helps someone out. Please let me know in the comments below. If it did help someone out, um, if you've got any questions, please ask and I will do my best to try and help you. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.